You want to find every schematic in Modern Warfare 3 Zombies. Well, you might be looking in the wrong places. Here's how to actually find all of the schematics in Modern Warfare 3 Zombies. Generally speaking, schematics are given to you within the reward rifts after completing contracts. However, the most important thing you must understand about schematics is that you find them in specific areas within Modern Warfare Zombies. Now, I want you to listen carefully here. You can mostly find any item within any contract reward, but the schematics, the one you need to craft those items in the menu, are tied to specific areas. For example, it is possible to find an epic aether tool in tier 1, even though you find the schematic for it in tier 3 and tier 3 alone. This is pretty game-changing information. I was under the impression that you could grind out contracts anywhere and just through time you would be able to find each and every schematic. That is not the case. Thankfully, I've made this beautiful chart to show you exactly where each and every single schematic can be found. As you can see, you'll find these schematics through completing tier 1 contracts. Once again, you can find these items in most other contract rewards, but the craftable schematics, those will be in Tier 1. You'll find these schematics by completing Tier 2 contracts, and you'll find these schematics through completing Tier 3 contracts. Additionally, some schematics are tied directly to story missions. This means you'll need to progress through the acts of your story missions to unlock these schematics. Now, Season 1 introduced 6 more schematics which have really cool ways to unlock them that are a little bit different than simply completing contracts. For the Bone, Golden Armor Plates, and Aether Blade schematics, you will need to go into the Elder Dark Aether. This means you'll need to find a sigil from Tier 3 contracts, go into the regular Dark Aether, then within the Dark Aether, and completing those contracts, find an Elder Sigil, which you can then use to open the Elder Dark Aether. Within the Elder Dark Aether, there are only three contracts to complete. However, every contract will give you a guaranteed schematic. The first contract you complete within the Elder Dark Aether will always give you the Dogbone Schematic. Which contract you do first does not matter. It will always give you the Dogbone Schematic. The second contract you do will always give you the Golden Armor Plate Schematic. And the third contract you do within the Elder Dark Aether will always give you the Aether Blade Schematic. Once again, if you find the Sigil and go into the regular Dark Aether, you can find the special items, but you need to use an Elder Sigil found within the Dark Aether and you Use that to go into the Elder Dark Aether to find these schematics. I wish they gave us an easier way of talking about these two areas because it can sound really confusing at first. However, unlike what most everybody says though, these areas are not Tier 4 and Tier 5. The zombies do not get any stronger or more difficult. They are just Tier 3 level zombies in a special area. It's not as bad as you think it is. It's pretty fun, honestly. Now, for the Legendary Aether Tool and the pack a -punch 3 Crystal and the Scorcher schematics, you will need to fight the Aether Storm Worm. This worm requires you to find four USBs around the map and wait for the Aether Storm to encompass some reactors on the map that you put the USBs in and fight this worm completely within the Aether Storm before the time runs out. Don't worry, it's incredibly easy and not as complicated as it sounds. Well, the worm is really hard, but the setup process is really easy. The worm though, yeah, that's a big fight. Luckily, every single time you defeat this worm, it guarantees one of these three schematics. Unfortunately, which schematic it drops is completely random, so you will probably have to do this multiple times to get everything you want. In fact, if you want to see me take on this Aether Storm Worm all by myself, may I add, be sure to check out this video and stay beautiful.